Good evening, chaps and chapettes. Roger here. Welcome back to Ronin Blade. Last time we managed to kill probably the worst, not worst, but most bloody annoying boss I've encountered in the game thus far, and slaughtered most of the village. So I think it's kind of giving me the thought that I'm supposed to go back to the to the guy to the guy. What's his face? Yeah, through the uh, through there to the dojo. But I didn't explore around here last time, and I have a feeling I lost, maybe lost some items for that, because, like I said, I've been saying there's been, there's so few healing items, and there's not been an opportunity to buy any. Hello, you're new. Oh yes, hide behind the flame zombie, you bastard. Well, the flame sword is, is proving it's flipping worth. I don't really want to go back to the dojo, because it's kind of given me that indication that that's that's where I need to be going so I've got two routes now I could have gone down these before I guess pigeon sonny that's still a stupid name but simply the fact is getting a better sword and keeping with the three hit combo just works rather nicely well this entire thing is now proven pretty darn handy considering I've now got healing again Ooh. Now, if that doesn't scream, he's Lordship's Castle. I don't know what bleeding does. Okay, yeah. Okay, so maybe if I go the other way, I'll get the same thing. But if I get items and or healing, well, that's a good thing now. I have to say, it's not really in my interest now to fight. But considering the game locks you into a screen until the baddies are all dead. Yeah, you just got to muller them. Oh, hello. Well, hopefully birding this way. Oh, ass nugget. There we are. Thank you very much. Hopefully by heading this way, I'll find somewhere other than the dojo where I need to go. Ooh. New area. I like the music track. So now where the hell am I? Raven Forest. You all right? I'm allowed to go here, even though the game's telling me to go back to the dojo, so... Oh, more you... More you guys. I'm assuming you're still some form of weird demon because you're making the right noises. Hello. Aha, aha, and a save point as well. So let's, let's save on up. See what the freaking haiku is this time. Because it's strange because I'm not sure if this is the right way or not. Because it's saying go back to the dojo, but I haven't encountered a do not go away and come back here. But either way, the hem of garments turn vermilion in autumn, hoping it never ends. Well, good view. I'm sure the fashion industry will be happy to hear that. Maybe? I don't fucking know. Ooh, green. So you're a poison bastard. Hmm. Ooh, a poison effect in a game where items are limited, and that's the only way to actually heal. That's, that's not good. Why are you looking in the wrong direction, Dick Muffin? Come back here, you flying bastard. Cool, Bennett, I'm not looking forward if those are the enemies of this area. It might be a case of I come back later. But then again, I don't know. Oh, shit me life. Well, at least they're one hitters. Look, can you finish your modern interpretive dance and come over here so I can kill you? Stop dancing around like a pillar and come over here and fight. Thank you. Come down here. Maybe it's on because there were a few games on the PS1 where you could only have one save file of the game per memory card, which was really annoying. And I've never, ever known why they did it. Well, the obvious answer is they did it because they, they had to. They did not have choices. Where the hell are you going, Kataro? Ganru Beach. Oh, that's the that's the guy from Tekken. That's the, that's the sumo from Tekken. I thought I recognised that name. Why the hell am I here? Why the hell am I even allowed to come here? Oh, hello. Well, yeah, you're a new enemy, but uh, I am getting the distinct feeling I'm not supposed to be here. Uh, maybe they literally forgot to code the, you know, I need to go to the dojo, I can't go here yet. Bit right, because this is all feeling very much not right. Well, I know this is the right way and I'm just being a complete bellend. I've gone from having no heeding whatsoever 
to literally being inundated with it. You see, this is, this is a boss arena. This is a boss arena for a boss that hasn't turned up yet. I'm going to skedaddle on back. Oh. Oh, this is different. I literally wandered up to the uh, northwest just to see if anything happened and yeah. Apparently Ito is trying to convince zombies through the dulcet tones of his to not completely kill him horribly. To be fair, that's that's about the right reaction. Oh, please don't tell me I have to keep him safe. Well, fortunately, I've got a freaking fire sword, mate. So you should be fine. Let me just show off for a bit. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. <laughs> please take anything but don't kill me, please. Do I seriously sound like those guys? You're a prat, mate. Oh, thank you. Well, too bleeding right, you should say that. Oh, I you my life. Is there anything I can do? Just say it. I eat... Oh, oh the tailor guy. The stuck-up tailor from earlier. Wait, can I go into a sh Oh, can I actually go into this shop? Oh, my saviour. Thank you for coming. Is anything anything I can do for you? Just name it. But what can you do for me? Uh, ah, oh, I know this is what I will do. With any clothing that suits you, it's yours. Come, come, get out of those horribly scruffy clothes. Armor, maybe. Okay. Oh, is it literally outfit change? Is it, oh, okay, it's just outfit change. Okay, so we got normal. We got. Some sort of bizarre pimp. We've got someone who uses a pimp. We've got someone who's about 13 and a half years old. And we've got... I don't know, someone from San, Fr San Francisco, but it looks a bit... I'm not massively fast, but... Uh, well, it's ninja, so that doesn't really match right. That's Pratt. Uh, oh, just for a change of pace, let's go with this. You look like an entirely new man. Okay, so you're a reskin. This, this is the equivalent of like the um, the clothing shop in like Resi 3, for example. You just happen to wander along and if you've got the right key, you can go in and change your stuff. In this case, I just had to go out my way for no reason whatsoever other than sheer curiosity. I really don't get why they've got invincibility frames whilst getting up. I really, really don't. Okay, well, I've gone back up the road. I've even gone back to the temple. Bizarrely, considering that the... The game has been pretty linear and the chapters have been pretty damn short thus far. It's now opened up a little bit. Well, to be honest, I've no idea how long the game even is, so... For all I know, this is this is the final chapter. The fact that I've maxed out the EXP bar would make me think that. Because I can understand why they make it so you can't just run off screen when there are enemies around. I do get that. It's just it's quite annoying when all you're trying to do is do some backtracking or... Going, from, going through somewhere you've already been because, like I said, now I was worried initially because enemies oh shit there we go, because enemies didn't despawn I was worried that I would not have the opportunity to get all the experience points but it's now been made abundantly clear that was never going to be a possibility otherwise I suppose I really should go back to the dojo now spent enough time pissing around but one thing I'm going to have to be bloody careful of now is, oh Andy is be careful because I did that wandering around earlier that I haven't just picked up all the healing items there are in the game. And I inadvertently screwed myself over by being a bit... Ooh, shall we say... less than restrictive of myself with their usage? There's probably a word for that. By the way, Dave needs to hang on because Katara is coming. Devouring the souls of evil ghosts and goblins, earthworms making cries. Are you just putting pins in a dictionary? I think that's what he's doing. Ah, here we go. Next chapter mirror. Okay, yeah, it's it's just a it's just a re it's just a retread of what you've just done. Hmm. No. Oh. Okay, and suddenly we're now in a 80s Japanese techno disco. Because why the hell not? But either way, we're gonna find out uh, what's happened to Dave next time. So, for the moment, 
Thank you very much indeed for watching this little video of mine. If you enjoyed it, have a little look see at the channel, see if there's anything else I've done which takes your fancy. If so, have a little look see. Barmies, barmies, my friend. Subscribe if you want to, but most importantly, please be wonderful to each other. Good night.